All right, and welcome back, citizens one and all, welcome back. So once you get the cauldron, you'll unlock the grasshopper treat, which is the insect eggs, which you'll get from killing most insects randomly. I see it most with butterflies and flying insects. Then you need petals, which you'll get from just chopping down the larger little um, flowers, like the poppies, or even the, the trees, the smaller saplings. Then you need seed oil, which you get from crushing it on the stone cutter right here. Seed oil is from seeds, which you get from cutting down rye, etc. So you get the grasshopper treat, you fight the grasshopper, get him to about half health, and as long as you have that grasshopper treat in your inventory, you will get the grasshopper. Uh, it will capture, it will have full health. I don't know how far it can jump, so let's uh, let's see what happens here. I don't know if you'll live through this or not, but we're about to find out. I bet you will die. I bet you will die. No? No? Okay. Just fell an obnoxious way down, and we're we're good to go. So the grasshopper's amazing, as you can see here with the jumping around. Very cool. And like all the other creatures, you can, you know, use the whistle. Summon him back to you. And if he's much further away, he will just appear next to you. And that is about all you need to know about the grasshopper for now. There are a few more things to cover with uh, insects that you can tame. Keep in mind that you'll eventually unlock saddles for most of these larger insects as well. So this is something to definitely keep in mind. But on that note, we'll call it there. Y'all take care. Please do like, subscribe, and share with your buddies.